Okay, so we created our high field. Let's just apply some of the basic materials for now. And we'll work with the shaders for this. So I'm going to add a surface layer for this. Okay, you'll notice it's right, right here. And a surface layer, let's go to enable color test. It's just a little bit brighter color so I can see the positioning. The one what I want to do, it is actually enable mask to this. So let's go click enable by mask shader. And we can just go ahead also right click going to the shaders, color shaders and from here select image map shader. Or we can also just assign inside it through the our maps. So we can create all these different types where you can access it. Um, right now we're going to just to select. Okay, let's go to shader, color shader and image map shader. And I'm going to select the flow for this. Okay, and we'll just repositioning and assign this to the mask map. Notice in preview we have in teeny tiny small piece right here in a corner. We want to size it properly. Because we did import from the origin file, if we look on high field open properties, right here you can see we have an X, Y mirror size. So this is what we wanted. Go ahead and copy those coordinates. And now inside image map size, we'll go to paste those coordinates. As well, we want position not loft, um, lower left, we'll go position to the center. Notice how it's right now in the properly layout and we can see right here in our preview, right in this area, you can see how the flow correctly distributed to this area. Okay, so this is nice uh, step one. And you notice we have it more than one map. So let's go ahead and create add a few more of those maps. Uh, for now, I will just disable this test color. Okay, we'll go click. And what I want to do, I'm um, just go and select all of this. We'll copy them and paste. So it's make a little bit faster for me to do this way. Um, next, I want to just connect in my workflow. Okay, oops, right here, dragging this connector to planet. Okay, and we can open our image map shader. And we can open file and just select, for example, deposits. Okay. And next, let's go actually, you know, till we here, let's go rename this. So we know which one sections what will be responsible. Okay, and we can actually paste one more time right here. Let's go select our workflow setup, input output notes. And we'll also this one will be set from flow, we'll go select this one to where. Okay, so we have it all those maps, we have it our four maps high field, we have it our um, flow deposit. Okay, actually, where will be right here. Okay, and our where set. Um, next, what we want to do, it's just play a little bit with the coloring. So we have it kind of more nicer material to look. Um, next, what I also want to do sometime it's add some of the rock layers, but it will be displacement rocks. So they will put it on the bottom right by the waterbed maybe. And um, we'll do this as well in next hour tutorials.